Nintendo just had their quarterly earnings call where they talk about what game sold how much, and I thought some were pretty interesting to talk about. The second most impressive game right here is Super Mario RPG, which sold 3 million copies. But why is that impressive? 3 million is a lot, but why do I think that's pretty interesting? Well, the original Mario RPG on the Super Nintendo sold 2 million copies. And yeah, I get it, more people have the Switch today than they had the Super Nintendo way back in the day, but I still think that's pretty impressive that a remake got to surpass its audience, because usually remakes only really appeal to people who played the game, and maybe a few more people who have heard of the game. Keep in mind, the game cover looks like this, not too interesting, right? I remember there being a discussion online that people thought the game wouldn't sell well because the cover looks really boring. Compare it to the one on the Super Nintendo, it looks a lot more interesting, a lot more stuff going on. No, apparently having a boring cover still allows you to sell 3 million copies of that game. The third most interesting stat here is Pikmin 4, not because it sold 333, 3 million sales, but because it's Pikmin. Yeah, Pikmin's cool, I just didn't think it was that popular, and honestly, good for Pikmin fans. I hope you guys get Pikmin 5 or DLC or whatever you guys want. And the number one most interesting stat here is Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. The game came out in 2014, it's nearly a 10 year old game, and it still sold nearly 7 million copies. Sales have been selling down, not because people aren't interested, but because enough people have the game. It's a good game, I'm just really surprised it keeps on selling over and over.